The Center for Biological Diversity and the Mountain Lion Foundation petitioned to list Southern and Central Coast mountain lions under the California Endangered Species Act, also known as CESA. So what is CESA? And do lions really need our help? Let's dive right in. Mountain lions once had the most expansive range of any terrestrial mammal in the Americas. In the United States, their range has been reduced to 15 Western states and a small remnant population in Florida. In California, they are the last remaining large carnivore. The California Department of Fish and Wildlife, also known as CDFW, plans to have a statewide and region specific mountain lion population estimate by 2022. Mountain lions in Southern California and along the Central Coast are facing an extinction vortex driven by genetic isolation due to habitat loss and fragmentation caused by roads and development. They also face high levels of human caused mortalities from vehicle strikes, rodenticide poisoning, and depredation kills. Scientists predict that mountain lions in the Santa Ana and Santa Monica Mountains are particularly at risk and could become extinct within 50 years if nothing is done to improve connectivity. And if inbreeding depression occurs, these lions could disappear within 12 to 15 years. Mountain lions in the Santa Cruz, San Gabriel, and San Bernardino Mountains appear to be trending towards a similar fate. CDFW estimates that automobiles kill about 100 California mountain lions every year. In a recent study, over 90% of tested mountain lions in California had highly toxic second-generation rodenticides in their blood. Such high levels of exposure could lead to internal bleeding, decreased fitness, and even death. Scientists have documented at least five mountain lions having died directly from rodenticide poisoning in the Santa Monica Mountains, including two healthy adult males in 2019. Such death brings this highly imperiled population closer to the brink of extinction. According to CDFW records, on average, at least 100 California mountain lions a year are legally killed after a depredation event or when a mountain lion is accused of killing livestock or pets that have not been adequately protected. P-56, one of only two collared breeding males in the Santa Monica Mountains, was legally killed in January 2020 under this system. Other causes of death include illegal poaching, disease, and human-caused wildfire. And although sport hunting of mountain lions is illegal in California, some mountain lion populations have lower rates of survival than heavily hunted populations in other states. So what is CESA and what does it stand for? The California Endangered Species Act establishes a statewide policy to protect species threatened with extinction and their habitat. CESA requires state and local agencies to promote the recovery and long-term survival of listed species. The CESA petition seeks protection for six genetically distinct mountain lion populations that inhabit the Central Coast in Southern California, which together comprise an evolutionarily significant unit, or an ESU. How would protection improve if Southern California and Central Coast mountain lions are listed? State endangered species listing would help to address the many threats that these lions face. First, local authorities would need to coordinate with state wildlife experts to ensure that approved development proposals adequately account for mountain lion connectivity. Second, state agencies would have a legal mandate to protect mountain lions, which would likely lead to much needed funding and construction of wildlife crossings on roads and highways. Third, state officials would need to reevaluate whether to allow the use of super toxic rat poisons in mountain lion habitat. Why does it matter? And why should you care about mountain lions in California? Mountain lions are both a keystone species and an ecosystem engineer. Their kills provide a reliable food source for scavengers, like the critically endangered California condors. Mountain lions exert such a substantial impact on the environment that the number of songbirds, fish, amphibians, reptiles, rare native plants, and butterflies would potentially diminish if this apex predator were lost. When we protect mountain lions, we protect other animals too. Let's talk about how you can take action for mountain lions. 
Ultimately, without a reversal of current trends, mountain lions will disappear from southern and central coastal California in the coming decades, representing a loss of the species from a significant portion of its range in the state. However, most threats facing mountain lions can be reduced. Legal protection of these mountain lion populations under CESA can help ensure the long-term survival of this iconic and ecologically significant species in Southern California and along the Central Coast. Here's how you can help. You can submit your comments to the California Fish and Game Commission at SaveCaliforniaLions.org. You can support wildlife crossing efforts like the Liberty Canyon Crossing by visiting SaveLACougars.org. You can also support organizations that work to improve connectivity and facilitate coexistence with wildlife 